The Nordstrom Anniversary Sale Preview is available for you to take a look at what is going to go on sale when the sale starts. I'm going to have all of the details of the sale down below. I always like to take a look at the beauty exclusives, so I thought we'd pull it up on my computer and take a look. I'm gonna do a good old bargain or bust. I haven't done one of those in a while, so I'm gonna go through and tell you what is a bargain and what is a bust. For the Nordstrom Anniversary Sale Beauty Exclusive page, I did take a look at the purses as well. There is one purse in particular that I have an eye on, um, and I'll share my favorites with you as we go, but let's get into it. I'm pulling up the link to the Anniversary Beauty Exclusive Sale, which I will have linked down below. So right now, I am on the entire Anniversary Beauty Exclusives page. We have a lot. So there's makeup, skincare, fragrance, tools and devices hair care, bath and body. So I'm seeing if you use this Kiehl's Body Moisturizer, you get this ginormous refill bag at a pretty good price. I'm looking at these Slip Pure Silk White King Pillowcase Sets, $220 value for $154. Oh, that's really expensive. I use Lily Silk sew cases and I'm perfectly happy with those, but Slip is a really, really great quality brand if you want some new silk pillowcases. Lots of Kiehl's I'm seeing. I'm not as familiar with Kiehl's. They have a few products that I enjoy, like the hand salve is great. You save six bucks. I mean, hey, if you need some, this is pretty good. T3 has the 1.25 inch ceramic curling iron for 113 though I will say normally around the end of the holidays slash Black Friday, T3 will have some really, really good sales. At least they did last year. So I would hold off probably until the Black Friday sale. So I would almost say this is a bust, but if you really need a good curling iron, T3 is a really great brand. Okay. <laughs> See, there also is a hair dryer here. Oh my gosh. I'm I'm not even gonna try and pronounce this, but this is pretty good. A fragrance discovery set, still 220, but this is a very pricey fragrance brand. I don't spend that much money on fragrances, so that is not for me. Oh, isn't this a hefty price tag for La Mer? Moisturizing cream, a $1,600 value for 1330. It's still a bust. I mean, that cream is beautiful. I've tried it before, but it's still a bust. Kylie Skin, why did I not know they sold Kylie skin. So these are lots of beauty tools. I'm not as familiar with them, which is why I'm passing by. I There's not much I can say about it. <laughs> but just so that you can take a look, right? I do like the Kate Somerville Exfoliate for $50 originally, $68. That's a decent sale price. Nothing crazy. Now this is what I strongly dislike and I think it is technically a bargain, but it's a bust. For the Nordstrom Beauty Exclusives, this is my bone to pick. An Orgasm Blush Duo, a $60 value for $40. Unless that is the only blush you're using, why are they selling two of the same thing? That is such a bust, not a bargain. We don't want the same thing. I hate when companies do that. Nordstrom, come on, man. Like, skincare, you know what? I can get behind them doing that for skincare. But makeup, no. Mm -mm. Especially with dusty old orgasm blush. I mean, don't get me wrong, or orgasm is beautiful, but we all have so many other blushes than orgasm. It looks like NARS has this velvet matte lip set for $49. That's cute, but I'm not really attracted to it. If you like the lip injections, which I think kind of went re-trending on TikTok, $42 for a set. Again, Nordstrom. Okay, I will give them this. Fix Plus is a little bit more essential than two orgasm blushes, but why do I need $42 of Fix Plus? Oh my goodness. Trish McAvoy, we have a brow set, $42. Nobody on YouTube uses Trish McAvoy, but my mom uses Trish McAvoy. <laughs> YSL has this mascara set for $39. If you like the YSL mascaras, I find that kind of dumb. So this is actually a really good bargain right here the ABH Deluxe Brow Kit. You get two different eyebrow pencils, though I don't really like the one on the most leftmost side because, I don't know, it's too big. I like a fine point. They do have the Brow Wiz and the Brow Gel, which is really good. Honestly, this is quite a good value. So this right here is a bargain. 
We have a Kopari set. I really like Kopari. They're one of my favorite skincare brands for like body care. Now, what I do go after for the Nordstrom Beauty Sales, it's oftentimes not beauty, it's fragrance. I love getting the Veluspa candles. Veluspa and Nest are my favorite like high-end boutique candle brands. And um, you know, I use my Bath and Body Works because I'm cheap, but I will normally treat myself to at least one candle set during every Nordstrom sale. So I see they have this Veluspa set of four petite candles for $39. This is something that I actually might end up picking up because I live in a small apartment I don't need a big three wick expensive candle so I like getting minis for my apartment so this is something that I actually do have my eye on and then there also is a candle trio from Nest I'm gonna have to go in person to smell everything but yeah I'm excited to take a look at the candle deals super goop has this glow sunscreen and glow stick duo for $41 I know super goop is really popular I have a few of their skincare items or sunscreen items that I enjoy but mm, you got me mad messed up if you think I'm spending $42 on shower gel. <laughs> I love Nordstrom, but sometimes I'm like, can't relate. Okay, I do know that better than sex is a holy grail for some people, but why? <laughs> why? I don't even think it's that good, but you can get two mascaras or it looks like a travel size as well for $44. It's a deal, but I think it's a bust. This also looks like a bust to me and extremely boring. The MAC Attire Eye Set, an $83 value for $45. This looks really uninteresting. I know we can't get a super good look at the colors here, but it it doesn't look that interesting to me. These are basic colors. Um, the mascara is okay. The eye cool is pretty good. No, that's boring. We don't like that. <laughs> I'm not seeing anything that's really calling my name. This is good. The Super Goop Sunscreen for $48 set. I do like that one. That one looks good. NARS Afterglow Lip Balm Trio for $49. Mm, I've never tried that formula, so. YSL, I've never tried this formula either, but $50 for two. If you like the colors, that's good. This Dior Attic Lip Set for $58. This is nice. Dior is such a trendy brand right now, and I think that this is actually a good deal. It looks like you get a lip maximizer, a lip serum, and a lip glow for $58 if you like the hydrating Dior lip sets. I do enjoy this one. I think that that's a bargain right there. Well, bargain is strong. And then this one is also good. If you do not have the Pillow Talk lip stuff from Charlotte Tilbury or you're running low, this is really good. $59 for a lip cheat, which is an essential in my makeup collection. This color right here, you'll use it for everything. A lipstick and I don't know what this last one is, the, the name at the top of my head. Or are these minis? I don't know. I hope they're not minis. As long as they're full size, this is a good deal. Okay, the Hyaluronic Happy Kiss Pillow Talk. But yeah, I mean, I think this is a great set for a gorgeous bridal lip. If you're getting married, this is a good set. I love Pillow Talk for brides as well. Okay, so that's good. I do like that. We have a Wild Mint and Eucalyptus Candle Duo from Nest. I don't think I'd like that. Oh, this is a good one too. Charlotte Tilbury always brings it. Pillow Talk Cheek Set. So you get the Pillow Talk Cheek to Cheek and the Beauty Light Wand. This is a good set, $54. I recommend this one. That one is nice. Both of those products are gonna leave your cheeks so stunning. We have a Sigma brush set. Mm, you can always get Sigma on sale. I'd hold off on that. If you use the Bifacil from Lancome, this is a good time to pick that up. I used to use that for years. Boy smells. Hmm. I think I looked at this last anniversary sale. I'd have to smell these because that's $65. And I need to see what size those candles are. Westman Atelier A, have they been in the sales before? Maybe I didn't have my attention to the brand in the past, but they have these squeaky clean liquid lip balm duo and for $57. I don't think I would end up getting this, but I'm intrigued because I've never tried this product from Westman Atelier. That color looks so beautiful. I mean, $57 is expensive, but I, I'll take a deal on Westman Atelier. They're a little... Spency. And then we have the Lancome mascara sets, which they've had for forever. Ooh, 
Ooh, okay, let's see Hourglass. So we have an exclusive palette, which normally eventually ends up coming out at Hourglass anyways. It only stays exclusive at Nordstrom for a specific amount of time. But this is a trio of powders to define, enhance, and finish the complexion from a lit from within glow. Let's, I hope I don't lose my space, but I, I don't know the colors. Do we know if these are new colors? It doesn't specify, okay. Ambient Lighting Powder in Luminous Bronze Light, that exists. Ambient Lighting Blush in Diffused Heat. And an Ambient Lighting Bronzer in Luminous Bronze Light. I believe all of these are repeat shades. I will have to fact check that and let you guys know, but I, I probably own these. So that's a little underwhelming. But I take it back if those are all new, but I don't think they are. But the Hourglass naming system could use some work. They just like reverse words and switch them in and out. <laughs> it's hard to tell. Um, some Trish McAvoy Eye Base, which, oh gosh, it's been years since I've used that. This one intrigues me always. I never end up doing it because who needs this much? But the Vitamin and Rich Face Base Duo Set from Bobbi Brown for $64. If you like it, if you use it every day, this is the time to pick this up because it is expensive. But I've noticed this going on sale a lot. So there are other opportunities, but this is a bargain. Of the Bobbi Brown Luxe Essential Eye Palette. Mmm, Bobby. It looks pretty. It looks very, very wearable, but that's something I'll be passing on. These Jo Malone sets are always so cute. The cutest. I don't own any Jo Malone fragrances, but those always catch my eye. I love the Kiehl's Ultra Facial Set, or the Facial Cream is really good. That's a good set. Only thing else interesting, a couple perfume sets. So I tried the Hourglass Veil Primer today. Actually, I've never used it before. I did a full face of Hourglass today. That primer is so good. I am so late to the game on that. And then the powder, of course, is really nice. This is a good deal of really great sample products from Hourglass. $72. So it's like a 30% discount. Those are very good products from Hourglass. I do like that set, but nothing is like exciting me. Ooh, I do like this fresh skincare scent. Fresh has some really great products. Okay, let's go on to the next page. New brow. This is always a good time to get new lash. I wonder if we'll see it. They usually have it on sale here. Another Jo Malone clone set. That one is for men's. That could be a good gift. They've changed the packaging on new lash. This looks nice. I get this every year. This is the first year that I'm not going to pick up the new lash set because I've stocked up so much that I have so many on backup now. But this is definitely something that is a bargain. These are really expensive and new lash really works. I always get asked, what lash serum I use. This is the lash serum that I use. It is amazing. And yeah, so this is the first year I'm not picking it up. I do like the new packaging, but I highly recommend that. Replica Jazz Set, that's cute. I don't really like that scent though. It's not my favorite. It's not sweet enough for me. A La Mer Hydration Set. This is actually a pretty good value given the price of La Mer skincare. This is a bargain for sure. So you, it's a five piece skincare set for $95, which is, Crazy, you got the cleansing foam, and I'm sure these are really tiny. Treatment lotion, renewing oil, and creme de la mer, which I love, but hoo hoo hoo. Um, I like that set. That's a bargain. It's gonna last you about two weeks, but it's a bargain. <laughs> okay, uh, this is $110 for those little things. <sighs> Boutique candles, man. I love them, but I hate them. Chloe, that's cute. I love the aesthetic of Chloe, just in general. Um, I know the Chantecaille Fossils Mascara is very popular. $103 for two if you use that regularly. That could be a bargain for you. It just depends if you're actually going to use the products or not. Chantecaille has a couple of skincare sets. So that's nice. Uh, I love the perfume sets. I think they are so beautiful. The Gucci ones always stand out to me as well. New Face. New Face is really trending. It really does, like, I've seen it work instantly where people will use it and their jawline is more snatched. So this is a good deal, $135 for the set and the cream. I'm kind of interested. I don't know that I'll actually bite the bullet and get it because that is not something that I need, but it's something that I want. So I I can see myself adding this. This is on my wish list. Okay, I like that. Ooh, I like this. Westman Atelier, the weekend set, $140. It's still expensive. It's not that good of a bargain. But you get a cream highlight, a cream bronzer, it looks like, and cream blush. They're all good products. Still like, kind of expensive, though. So in terms of value, maybe not the best. 
this is kind of good for hair. Lots of perfume sets. I'm not a perfume expert. To Wall Sue First Care Serum Duo. I do really love this serum. I actually got to do an ad for Suwalsu with this. It is very, very nice. It's a bit excessive to have two, but if you love it, it's a nice serum. GHD. Love GHD strainers. They last forever. Charlotte Tilbury Magic Cream Set, $196. Apparently a $280 value. You guys know I love my magic cream, so... I like that. And let's head on to the last page of the Beauty Deals MAC Lip Glass Set. Mm, I'm over that. $22 though. I bet you they're tiny. These Capri Blue candles look super cute. Mm, here's this. More orgasm. Oh, okay. This is a set I always get. I'm getting this one. The Veluspa set of five tin candles for $36. That's going to be mine. And side note, I love this deodorant from Kopari. That's a good deal just to get a bunch. Briogeo. Oh, I like this too. This is a good deal too. I like these sets from Briogeo. Bargain. Um, this is cute. I'm always tempted to get these from MAC. This lipstick set, you get five mini lipsticks for $35. And it's just a really great way to get a bunch of colors. It's a great gift to give. If you have a teenager, it'll give them a nice collection. I like my home too. Mm. These two lip sets from MAC, I think are a bargain. I do like those. My college roommate used to wear this Stila eyeliner exclusively. This would have been perfect for her. I haven't used that in years. And this MAC set actually looks kind of valuable. Okay, okay. This is nice from Benefit, right? The Gimme Brow and Brow Pencil for $33. That's good. I like that. That's a bargain. The Bobbi Brown, all these are all boring to me. I could never get into these eyeshadow pencils from Charlotte Tilbury. They're good. I'd have to, what colors do these come in? Light pink? <sighs> $35, that's good. Actually, that's a pretty good value if you're into that kind of product. Bobbi Brown also has a similar one. Curl liqueur. Ooh, cure liqueur. I thought it said curl. And that's it for beauty. Um, I'm not into it. Normally, Charlotte Tilbury has a palette or something. An hourglass has a palette, but it looks like the hourglass is on repeat. Checking to make sure I didn't miss anything. Yeah, I don't like the beauty deals this time. There really is not that many that interested me. There's only 44 makeup deals, and they're like the double orgasm. Like, who needs that? No, I'm not. I don't know that I'm going to pick anything up. I'm going to pick up the candles for sure. But I'm not screaming for the beauty products. I really am not. Let me know your thoughts. Do you agree with me? Now, what I did see on the anniversary preview that I was interested in, I haven't looked through the clothes and shoes. I usually find an item or two that I'm interested in. But in terms of handbags, the only ones, well, okay. The weekend travel bag, this is a really good deal from Base. This is Shea Mitchell's brand. $67 for the weekend travel bag. I just bought this for my mom for her birthday and I got it in black and I'm super angry that this deal did not exist because matcha and sakura, look at these colors, $67. I already have so much luggage and I also don't go anywhere. But if I did travel, I would buy this. This is such a good deal. And the bag, the bottom part zips off and you can put shoes in it. I really like that. This is a good time to get base stuff. And then what else did I see? And then the only other item that really interested me were ones from Coach. And they have a few colors on the Nordstrom sale. So like this one is $199. I think that that is so cute. This is the one I'm looking at. Either the black or the this one. I really like the nude. I think that I might get this one right here. It's so beautiful and it's $200. Originally, it's $350. That's what people are normally paying. This is not an outlet bag. This is a retail bag. So these don't go on sale. So for me, this is the biggest bargain of the sale, in my opinion, that I, I want to get $150 off. Oof, I love that. Okay, yeah. I think I'm getting this. I limit myself now to buying one pricier bag a month. And this, I think, is going to be my July bag. 
I love this taupe color. I think it is so cute. Yep. That's going on my wish list. That's what I'm getting. Anyways, you guys, that was my Nordstrom anniversary preview sale thoughts, bargain or bust. For the most part, pretty well underwhelmed. Um, I'm gonna take a look at the clothes and the shoes. I usually like that, but in terms of beauty, I'm not feeling it. <laughs> Let me know your thoughts down below. What are you interested in? What are you passing on? I would love to hear it. And with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful. Thank you so much for spending your time with me and I will catch you guys in the next one. Bye guys, have a good one. Thank <laughs> you.